Roger and I are here at Melbourne Central because we're at a pretty cool event. We've gone to a couple of events recently. You went to the Foxtel uh, Fox Footy Season opening. Season launch. Season oh, launch. No, it was a, it was a four course gourmet meal. Uh, turn in all of your footy classics into gourmet dishes. It was unreal. Well, that was absurd. We both went to the Fox Footy launch on the Yarra. Yeah. And now tonight, we're at the AFL 23, uh, the launch of the new game. So we're going to get to play the game, and there's some star-studded people on the list. And this is unbelievable news for you. This is a whole other year or two of content. Just I know. <laughs> pumping straight out of one video game. You're absolutely blessed. I, I can't remember the last time I played a video game, but that's all right. I'll start clicking some X's and O's and see how we go. I'm not a gamer, but I like sporting games. Yeah. I would say if you could combine all the AFL games into one, I know they've been with different makers and whatnot, I would say that's the game I played the most. I played AFL and then it would be FIFA. And you played it, AFL more than FIFA? I, I would say. I would You'd say. be one of the only ones, I reckon. I know, I just love it though, so I can't wait to sink our teeth into the new one. Some star started names coming, I think. Track, Vine, yes. Tommy Mitch, Sheasel's here tonight. The Sheasel, the Sheasel's nose! <laughs> we haven't <laughs> seen that great man for a while and he's doing bits, so it looks like we're early. It doesn't look like there's a lot nah. happening. No, it's the first time you are fashionably early. I'm a yeah. late man. Usually you're about a 10 minute later, but that's okay. We'll, uh, we'll wait, we'll bide our time and Eddie. feature this, we're currently working with the AFLPA to work out how we can get legends and current players into the game together for the first time ever. Um, it's a dream to be able to make this game. Um, it's a dream to make a game of a sport that you actually love. Thank you. Hey, with the prime train. My guy, my guy, Kados. How are you, my friend? You good? Oh, my loyal. <laughs> how many how many beers tonight have you had? Oh, two. Uh, <laughs> uh, this is awesome. How, how good is this? Mate, it's unbelievable. We were just saying before how many uh, stars there are around us. And, um, and I was saying, who are the most stars struck in the Oh, that's the retirement. You've got to be Chef Track, doesn't it? And I, and I got to chat to the great man. Oh, how is he? I failed him. Up. He wanted to know who you are. I think he knows me of the guy who hangs around the chamber and everyone can. Um, he's a ripper. He is a ripper. What are you? Have you played the game yet? No, I haven't. Have you? I have not. But okay. I wouldn't mind getting a bit of a prime train career mode going. Just yeah. Let's <laughs> get it going. That's all. I'll do it myself, and I'll make myself <laughs> nine rated as I should be. I'm here with the man who's on the cover of AFL 23 track. How are you feeling about being on the cover? It's pretty cool. I grew up playing FIFA in 2K and seeing the covers of that, and. Uh, I played AFL Live 04 growing up, did you play that? Justin Lepich on the cover. I didn't play 04, I played 05, 06, 07. Okay. 04 was good, you could take hangers on no yeah, one. They keep telling me that. It was good, you could take hangers on no one. Josh Fraser won me the Brownlow. And then that's where that Joe Mercedes picture came from. <laughs> like, absolutely big. Pretty cool being a gamer growing up, it's, uh, it's a pretty amazing feeling. Nah, it's unbelievable. Um, do you know your rating yet? Or I wouldn't have a clue. Yeah, Hopefully high 80s. What, as a Melbourne supporter, what do you think? Say like high 90s. And, and <laughs> kick, kick, uh, set shot accuracy? Oh, I'd say low 30s. <laughs> <laughs> how are the boys feeling going into uh, this week against the Lions? Be a good game. It's an exciting game. Obviously, everyone's saying we have a rivalry between them, but I don't I don't really see it. I think it's just two good teams that are going at it, playing a big final together, but um, it's exciting. Obviously, we've got a few, few inclusions, which is good. And, um, and up there at the gap, we travel well, so it's a good game. I love watching your bikes travel. You just win all the ones away. For me, there was years and years we couldn't win in Perth, couldn't win in SA, and then we just take the piss. What happens when you guys travel together? We, well, we, I think we just bond better. We just, uh, obviously, we're all in the same hotel. We eat dinner together. We, we uh, what else? Do we, we don't sleep together. I was gonna say we sleep <laughs> together. <laughs> 
We had dinner together, we have team meetings, we go for walks. I think it's, uh, I also think when you go to this is 22 to go on the coach, so I feel like you get a, you get a lot more connected out there, it's, uh, it's awesome. Are you going to be vlogging your trip? Because you've been doing a lot of TikTok vlogging. Been doing a lot of vlogging, it's been good it's fun. Up, it's, it's actually some of the best content I've seen. Oh, thank you very much, I really appreciate it. No, it's exciting, I think, uh, I always get asked this question, I always say that Growing up, I was a Collingwood supporter, and Pendlebury was my favourite player. And um, I always used to look up YouTube videos of him, and I never got that access to have this. And I think social media these days, as you know, it's awesome to have that content and be able to give back to the young kids. So uh, I really enjoy filming it. I love doing the cooking stuff. My fiance, I mentioned her as well. She's uh, she's amazing. She does all the editing for me, so she's great. Mate, you're nailing it. Keep smashing it. Go D. Oh, Thanks so very much. Go so good. It's been an unbelievable event, hasn't it? I just can't get my head around how they've finally managed to make an AFL game look like a legitimate sort of international prospect. I haven't played it yet, but you reckon it's good. I'm about to play it. I'm two minutes away from playing it, but you rate it. To be honest, I'm the wrong bloke to ask. Like, I just do not play video games. But I was up there, and I went, this seems like I'm playing FIFA. That's what it felt like. That's got me so excited. The Vineys are up there at the minute. Um, we're about to kick him off and then we're going to give it a go. It's about time we stop taking the piss out of an AFL game. Let's get an AFL game we can be proud of this time. Raj, about to debut with AFL 23. You're about to get turned to dust, mate. We have to play against each other. Oh, we play yeah, against we each other. Play against... But I have no idea what I'm doing, mate. This is going to be a match. D's baggers, Raj? I think that might be the go, yeah. Go, go the Clash jumper. You go the Clash. Right stick. You yeah. flick it. Oh, what do I do? Right. Up to the so you, you just use your, you, so you just move the, the, the stick and then hold circle for power. And then like a uh, now. And then get ready now. Time in for circle again. Get in there. Oh, you nailed it. <laughs> He's nailed it straight through the middle. <laughs> oh no. Oh, Bailey no. Fritch. No, no. Bailey Fritch to win no, the game. No, no, no. I just can't be real. <laughs> Lining up from 35 out. Look at him. Oh, Fritter's going bananas. The D's are home. 